the unmerciful servant. Matthew 18, 21 to 35. Then Peter came to Jesus and asked, Lord, how many times shall I forgive my brother or sister who sins against me? Up to seven times? Jesus answered, I tell you, not seven times, but seventy-seven times. Therefore, the kingdom of heaven is like a king who wanted to settle accounts with his servants. As he began the settlement, a man who owed him ten thousand bags of gold was brought to him. Since he was not able to pay, the master ordered that he and his wife and his children and all that he had be sold to repay the debt. At this the servant fell on his knees before him. Be patient with me, he begged, and I will pay back everything. The servant's master took pity on him, cancelled the debt, and let him go. But when the servant went out, he found one of his fellow servants who owed him a hundred silver coins. He grabbed him and began to choke him. Pay back what you owe me, he demanded. His fellow servant fell on his knees and begged him, Be patient with me, and I will pay it back. But he refused. Instead, he went off and had the man thrown into prison until he could pay the debt. When the other servants saw what had happened, they outraged and went and told their master everything that had happened. Then the master called the servant in. You wicked servant, he said. I cancel all the debt of yours because you begged me to. Shouldn't you have had mercy on your fellow servant just as I had on you? In anger, his master handed him over to the jailers to be tortured until he should pay back all he owed. This is how my heavenly Father will treat each of you unless you forgive your brother and sister from your heart. The first activity is to read the story from the Bible, which we have just read. The second activity is to number the sentences below in order. The third question, what did the king say to the servant? This can be found in Matthew 18 verse 32 to 33, in which the king said, Shouldn't you have mercy on your fellow servant, just as I had on you? The fourth question, What will God do if we do not know how to forgive others? God cannot forgive our sins when we fail to do the same to others. The fifth question, have you ever forgiven someone? How did you feel after that? Indeed, I have, and I felt better. Question number six. Do the multiplications below to decipher the code. Then you will know how we feel when God forgives us. Seven times seven equal fourteen. This is A. 15 times 7 is 105, and this is E. 8 times 7 is equal to 56, and this is I. Using the code, we can decipher the message. Write the letter A under the number 14. Write the letter E under the number 105. Write the letter I under the number 56. You can finish deciphering this code after you have done all the multiplication in the previous question. In this section, you just tick your answer in the boxes. 
So remember, kids, God will forgive our sins just as we forgive others. Thank you.